Hello friends, how are you? Friends, uh, today um, I will talk about profession. What will be your profession? Usually it is a very general and common problem among the students, among the career-oriented people uh, who are looking for career, which career to choose. And uh, they have uh, always uh, a query that what will be our profession. If someone come to you uh, with their horoscope, uh, they have uh, two, three very general queries. Uh, what will be my profession? Uh, when will I get married? And uh, what, uh, what will be my finances? So today uh, we are going to talk about a very important topic that is profession. And uh, what will be a profession and uh, from astrology, uh, how uh, you can get to know about your profession very easily. It's a career astrology. Today we will deal. So friends, uh, first we uh, see which houses of the horoscope influence the profession most. First house of the horoscope, which is known as the ascendant, show general attitude and lifestyle of the individual. Second house represents monetary advantage, self-acquisition, bank balance, assets. Third house represents um, your abilities, your hobbies, your interest, your abilities to handle a job service. Fifth house is for your intelligence speculation. It's for intelligence and intellect. Sixth house tells about job, authority in job, place of employment, conditions of work. Eighth house represents sudden changes, sudden, it's the house of suddenness, sudden gain, sudden loss, sudden changes, termination of job is also seen from this house. Ninth house tells about your fortune, it's a house of luck. Tenth house is the main house of uh, profession, career. 11th house represents your income, uh, income, cash flow. Along with the above houses, we need to examine the condition of the luminaries, the sun and the moon, as they are fundamental to the personality play and important role in determining the career. As we know that the 10th house is the main house of the profession and the planets in it play a key role in deciding about your career. So if there is sun, then you can be in the profession which needs authority. You can be a politician, you can be a scientist, you can be a doctor, you can be a leader, director, government employees, you can be a jeweler too. Moon is a planet of emotions. And if it is in the 10th house, you can be in the nursing profession. Uh, you can be uh, in, the, in the profession uh, which is related with the public you can be social worker you can be a politician uh, you can be a profession related with the women children you can be uh, in the profession uh, related with traveling marine cooks you can be a cooks restaurant you can be in the profession of trading import export if mars is there in the 10th house uh, then you can be in the profession related with fire, energy, matters. You can be related with the profession which needs uh, leadership, initiative. You can be in the uh, arms and ammunition department, weapons. You can be related in the profession related with the weapons, construction. You can be in the profession of uh, land, uh, 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 real estate. You can be a soldier, police, surgeons, engineers. If there is Mercury in the 10th house, then you can be in the profession which required a lot of intellect, a lot of intelligence. Um, you can be a good writer, you can be a good teacher, you can be a, you can be a good businessman, you can be a clerk, you can be a um, computer typist, you can be accountant, editor, transport, astrologers. Uh, good uh, good astrologers need to be uh, their mercury uh, in very good condition 
if there is uh, jupiter in the 10th house then you you can be in the profession um, related with finance related with law treasury scholars priest you can be into profession um, like professor politicians um, you can be in the administration uh, job mba uh, advertising is in c psychologist or uh, you can be a good director guidance guide you can be into profession hr manager humanitarian if there is a venus in the 10th house then uh, you you can be in the profession related with places uh, traveling um, uh, luxuries beauty art music films entertainment industry hotels if there is saturn in the 10th house then uh, you can be in the profession related with real estate labor agriculture building trades mining monk if there is rahu then you can be a good politician you can be into the profession related with the uh, camera related with computers related with the uh, uh, films advertising agency engineer uh, physician uh, you can be into the profession um, medicine drugs speculators aviation industry electricity and waste if there is ketu in the 10th house then you can be into the profession uh, related with idealism and enlightenment religion secret affair poisons metaphysics you can be a good spiritual teacher you can be a astrologer also um now we will check uh, houses in the house ko related with the uh, career so the uh, this is the first house uh, which shows your overall personality your interest your attitude uh if 10th lord in these houses uh, you can also decide about your career uh, first house means uh, self employment politics public at large body health club if 10th lord in second house you can be into banking investment accountants gastroent or into family business teaching consultant psychologist writing if uh, your 10th lord in third house you can be into communication uh, you can be into arts profession sales advertising computing writing publishing if it is in the fourth house you can be in, in the profession related with agriculture building trades real estate vehicle water geology mining if it is in the fifth house you can be uh, into the profession related with politics stock uh, brokers religious or ritual activities entertainment author authorship sixth house uh, for lawyers military police labor health related professional food waiters what uh, uh, what are the things sixth house denotes uh, denotes sixth house is related with that litigation enemies main main things these three so you can be into the profession related with these seventh house means business trade market females foreign business eighth house is for insurance research that related metaphysics Nine thousand for law, university teaching, uh, travel, religious professions, foreign countries. Ten mm-hmm. thousand is for uh, government jobs dealing with public and the masses, managers, politics. Eleven thousand trade and business accountants, financial institutions, group work. Twelve thousand is for foreign job requiring secrecy, travels, hospitals. prisons asylums charity advocacy let's see with a with an example chart uh, this is the chart this is the horoscope here you can check this is the cancer ascendant horoscope saturn in ascendant venus is second house in uh, leo uh, mercury exalted in third house sun rahu in fourth house in libra 
जुपिटर एटो गेट इन नाइन्थ हाउस पाइसीज केतु इन टेंथ हाउस एगीज मून इन टॉगस इलेवेंथ हाउस मार्स इन मर्करी साइन जामिनी इन ट्वेल्थ हाउस लेट सी In this example chart, tenth house has Ketu, while tenth lord in Mercury sign, a dual planet. We have seen uh, Mars in twelfth uh, house in Mercury sign, Gemini. Mars in Jupiter, Navansh. From tenth, uh, from Sun, tenth lord is Moon, and moon, from Moon, tenth lord is Saturn. Both in Mercury, Navansh. Here, native work is related with communication, teaching, writing, also practicing astrology. In tenth, in D uh, D uh, D ten chart, the Shamsha chart, tenth lord Saturn again in third house in Gemini, and in D nine tenth lord in third again. So here Mercury and Jupiter are the main planets which play key role in deciding native uh, native career. So friends, uh, this is the video related with profession. How can you decide about your profession? How astrology? Uh, guide you in deciding about your profession if you like this video please share and subscribe share this video and subscribe this uh, youtube channel thank you